Hi guys, it's been almost a month since I got my new bounce boots and today I'm going to be doing a review video for them. Now this video is not going to be going into the benefits of rebounding or using rebound boots. That I'll save for another video and there's plenty of other information out there regarding that. Also you could check out some of my other videos from the past on my kangaroo jumps and I do go into a lot of information about why I use rebounding boots when I run and do everything else. But I did want to just do a quick review with this. Just like with my kangaroo jumps, I love these boots as well. Um, what I really love about them is the color, so that I was able to get brighter colors. I am definitely more noticed. I've had a lot of people stop me and ask me what they are. So keep that in mind. If you're trying to get a serious run in using this, you will be stopped a lot. Now the main difference I found between using these over kangaroo jumps, which I liked a lot better, is that these feel a little bit bouncier. And I believe they, well, so they have said it's the band that they use. It's shaped a little bit differently, and that may be it. But to be fair, also, it could also be that they're new bands. Because my the bands on my kangaroo jumps were very, very old. And as they wear down, they tend not to be as bouncy. But I really don't think that was that. I do believe it's the new style of band that did make it feel a little bit bouncier. makes you jump a little bit higher and a little bit more. Which, of course, makes the workout a lot more fun. That's the whole purpose of getting these, right? I really recommend them over the kangaroo jumps, mainly because of the price and because they are an upgraded or newer model. So they took all of the things that were not working so well with the kangaroo jumps and incorporated into here. So over time, people complain about this or that, little minor things. They kind of fixed it. So for a lower price, you are kind of getting a better boot. Other than that, the comfort was very comfortable. I don't know if I felt much of a difference between these and the Kangoo's, but they're great and hopefully they're, they'll last a little longer. As I said in my last video about these, I will probably do an update sometime in the future, and maybe six months down the line, who knows when, when it comes time to changing the parts because my biggest complaint with the Kangoo jumps was changing the bands. They were not easy to do and I don't believe the average person would be able to do that. If you want a pair of these, I do have it linked below how to get them. And I will do upcoming videos on this, on my baking, my travel. I do have a cruise coming up next month, July 21st. We're going back on the Anthem of the Seas. For those of you who love my cruise vlogs, keep that in mind. And much more baking. So stay tuned, subscribe, and I'll see you all next time.